Right as mosquito season kicks in, a new method of mosquito control is creating a buzz in San Bernardino and LA counties. Yeah, KCAL's Nicole Comstock says it's actually cutting the number of the pesky pets, pests, <laughs> nearly in half in some areas. A public health expert we spoke with tonight tells us this is the first time they've seen a reduction in this invasive mosquito population since it was first detected here in Southern California a decade ago. Unleashing containers full of sterilized mosquitoes into Inland Empire and LA County neighborhoods. Vector control workers have been doing this for over a year now to cut down on the dreaded 80s ankle biters. Nobody likes to get bit by a mosquito, you know. Uh... So anything that'll work is fine with me. Yeah, that's what we have. John Park says he usually blasts those little buggers with insect spray. His Rancho Cucamonga neighborhood has previously been a mosquito hot spot. And haven't seen any mosquitoes at all this year so far. So knock on wood that it stays that way. It's surely shaping up that way. The ankle biter population has reportedly dropped by 44% in some mosquito heavy areas in San Bernardino County and by 82% in Sunland Tahunga after two vector control districts introduced the sterilized mosquitoes. Yes, it's very exciting. People uh, will stop us and tell us, oh, thank you. This year is much better. Dr. Solomon Burhani is the scientific director for the West Valley Mosquito and Vector Control District. He says the 80s population in SoCal increased every year for the past 10 years. So population reductions of this size are a big deal and help prevent the spread of disease. After our papers uh, went out, I have seen some uh, agencies being interested. But scaling targeted programs like these to larger areas would require time and resources. In LA County, for instance, officials have said it could cost homeowners about $20 per year. West Valley Vector says medium sized areas don't require as big of a budget. The resources that it requires, because area wide requires a lot of resources. Mm -hmm. Compared to target, target is you select sites based off your. Uh, surveillance data. And some neighborhoods in the Inland Empire saw up to a 65% reduction in this mosquito population when they also introduced other methods like bringing mosquito fish into ponds and fountains. Reporting in Rancho Cucamonga, Nicole Comstock, KCAL News.